Netherlands. Colin Fleming is courtside and is going to have a chat with the winner after the longest match of his career. Felix, uh, a huge congratulations. What an incredible match you and Dominic have put on here uh, on the Margaret Court Arena. But just first of all, what, what's the overriding emotion after that one? It, the emotions must be everywhere. Yeah, a lot of relief. Uh, you know, it's crazy, these matches, you go through really all the emotions. Uh, it was a great level, great match. I started well, and then, and then it's a sport, you know. Sometimes it sucks. <laughs> you, you're trying, to, you're trying your, your best, and then he also, you know, played well. He started well, and it was a, it was a struggle for me. But, you know, at the end, I didn't want to, I didn't want to fail mentally. You know, I didn't want to disappoint myself uh, with my effort. I didn't want to have any regrets uh, leaving the squad today. So, you know, even it was frustrating uh, the way it went in the third set. I thought, you know, you need to be tough. You need to stay strong, and and I'm happy I did because now I'm, I'm really happy. And. You mentioned the third set, it was looking like an impeccable performance to there. Your two sets, your 5 2 up in the, the third set tie break. Dominic, a great effort from him to come back. We're all the way to the fifth. What do you tell yourself at the start of the fifth set? I think you faced the break point or two even in the first game. What's going through your head there, and how did you manage to spin it in your favor? Um, in all honesty, not a lot of good things. <laughs> you know, we try to, we're good actors, I guess. Uh, not always, you know, but we try to be good actors when we're on the court. We try to stay calm. You know, we're also facing the opponent and we try to show a, a strong demeanor, show a strong body language. But, uh, you know, leaving the, leaving the court after the third set, I mean, I had to, I had to regroup. You know, it was, it was tough. Uh, I was really seeing myself win that third set. I was playing great tie break, like you said, 5-2. And then, you know, just two poor points in a row. And then the match is, turns around just like that, you know. That's, but that's tennis, you know, it's all right. And four hours, 59 minutes, you've set yourself a new record. It's the longest match of your career. Congratulations on that. I'm not sure if it's a record you wanted or not. But it's obviously uh, late into the Melbourne night now. I just got to get a word from you on this uh, fantastic crowd that have stayed here to support both of you. It was uh, a brilliant atmosphere out here. No, I mean, it got, the noise was crazy. Like, <laughs> thank you, everybody. It was uh, after... Even after I lost uh, the third set, the fourth set, I mean, it was tough for me, but um, you want to play in these type of atmospheres, I think, for, for Dominic and I, you know, it was a, it was a, you know, a great match, uh, one that we'll definitely remember. Um, I'd be even happier if that was the final and I was, you know, resting now, but <laughs> it's only the first round, so I'll try to, you know, I'll try to recover well and get ready for the next matches. Well, as you say... Felix, you're through to the second round. It was an absolute pleasure to watch you and Dominic tonight. Congratulations once again. Ladies and gentlemen, through to round two, Felix Oji, Ali Asim. Wide World of Sports is your home of the Australian Open. With highlights of every match of the AO, the on-court interviews, and every day with the morning serve, you'll be ahead of the game. So click that subscribe button so you don't miss a thing this Australian Open.